All right, welcome back to the Knives Fast channel, guys. Trust me, it's a nice fast channel. And this is going to be fun. You can see this is from Obi, and it's a big box. So let's lift it up and say hello to Ren and Stimpy, Powder Toast Man, Log, and TV, and Choo Choo, and get started on the Nice Fast channel. If you're not subscribed, please consider doing so, guys. There you go, Nice Fast channel. See, like you, like you can see it now. So uh, this box comes by way of Obi. Uh, you guys know I'm an affiliate with O Knife. Uh, this is a little different. This is Obi. This is their outdoor camping, that kind of stuff, um, store. And so I'm going to open this. Uh, let's see. Can I open it on camera? Yeah, I guess I can. Uh, I just don't want to show the label. So we'll we'll kind of be careful here with our Keith the Knife Freak uh, unboxing F-150 knife here. And uh, we're going to see what we have. I mean, I know what it is. Uh, but you guys are going to see what it is. Now, this is something they asked if they could send me. Now, you guys will see down in the description of this video. First of all, you will see lots of bubble wrap. Uh, you will see down in the description of this video uh, some links, guys. And if you use those links, I'm an affiliate, uh, obviously, with Olight and now with Obi. And you can help the channel and you can see down there, uh, you know, how to get over to Obi now. We have a fixed blade to check out, as you can see here. Let's see what we've got. This is the Fortitude in D2 and G10. Uh, very cool looking fixed blade. Very, very awesome. Now, I do not know, guys, um, who makes these. Now, you know, most of the, all of the folding O knives that I've seen uh, have been made by Kaiser, but I'm told this uh, fixed blade is, is made by another manufacturer. Uh, they weren't. They didn't disclose who it was, but uh, it's not Kaiser. So that's an interesting thing, and we'll see. So right off the bat, guys, we have a Fortitude patch with a bear. Look at that. That is cool. So I will not open that because at some point I'm probably going to give this away. Uh, well, I got to check with them first and make sure I can. But yeah, if I can, I'm going to. So I don't want to open that up. Uh, right now, but we're going to leave that right there and we're going to move this box out of the way. First things first, you got a uh, Kydex sheath with a, um, shoot, I can't remember the name of these things, Tech uh, tech Lock uh, there for carry. All right, we've got a little um, uh, owner's manual here and the knife. All right, let's see if I can get it out of it. It's packed in here really well because I don't want you to cut yourself here. Take the little protective tip off, and there we go, guys. So right off the bat, I tell you what, I am going to lighten up, brighten up my light just a little bit here. There we go. So you've got this Contour G10 with these really cool kind of, uh, you know, uh, pattern in here, obviously, from the contour. But then you've got these lines here for grip. You've got contouring down here. You've got a uh, spot for a lanyard back here in the back. And a coated blade. Now, this is D2, but with coating, uh, probably going to be just fine, especially for outdoor camp. Ooh, okay. Somebody understands ergonomics. Uh, that's nice. Now, I've got kind of this little poon area up here to kind of rest my thumb in. I don't need jimping there. I do have some jimping back here if I choose to grip it like this. Ooh, nice four-finger grip, and it is rounded and awesome in the hand, guys. This thing is very nice uh, in the hand. Uh, there we go. We've got uh, D2 O knife over here, and then Fortitude and the model number over here. I love this clip point, almost buoy like blade. You got a thumb ramp here, a guard down here at the bottom, and a sharpening choil with plenty of relief for your blade. And like I said, you do have uh, a nice um, full tang knife. And you have the uh, lanyard hole there with the cutout. So that will work really well. And man, I'm not kidding. These contoured scales feel great. All right, let's see how it feels or fits in the sheath. Very nice positive there. And you kind of got a nice spot for your thumb to hit. And just, whoa, knock Ren and Stimpy and over, everybody over. Did you guys see that? Uh, I think I'm going to be sued here in a minute by Ren and Stimpy and especially by Choo Choo. Jason, uh, if Jason was still here, Jason Brown, he would be laughing his head off right now at me being a goofball. Uh, so you're welcome, Jason. Be up, everybody. 
And uh, there you go. What a goofball. So uh, really good positive grip on that, on that. No rattle, no rattle. You do have it uh, set up for uh, uh, horizontal carry. I mean, excuse me, vertical carry. Wow. Uh, but you can, yeah, you, I think you, yeah, you can change this to, um, you should be able to change it to uh, horizontal if you want to. It's a pretty big one, so it would be good that way. Very, very nice. Let's be more careful this time. So yeah, nice sheath. I like that a lot. Very well done. So again, uh, guys, there will be a link. This is just simply an unboxing, but there will be a link down below to own an O by website. And on that website, you can pick up this uh, Fortitude and you can help out the channel, obviously, when you do that. Uh, so definitely go check this out. This is interesting. Okay. So yeah, they asked if they could send it. Some of you guys have been asking. I know all of you aren't into fixed blades, but more and more of you have been asking me uh, to check out some fixed blades. So I've been trying to do that. Um, I have more on the way. Um, but yeah, this one is very interesting. So I am very glad uh, that Obi sent this along. Very, very cool. So that is the Obi O, o knife. Well, you can see it's called the O knife uh, Fortitude here, not the O buy, but you buy them at O buy. Uh, it's not on the normal O light website. It's over at O buy. So there you go. Wow, that was a lot of words to try to say something that was fairly simple. But um, yeah, that's what I do here. I mess everything up. But uh, there you go, guys. Let me know what you think of this fixed blade. And are you looking forward to the review? What questions do you have? Uh, well, for when I do the review, do you have anything specific that you would like to uh, see or hear about? Now, um, again, like I said, don't forget the links down below. And uh, did I miss anything here? G10 handle. Uh, so it's 10.89 ounces, but what I don't know is if that is uh, in the sheath or without, but we'll do that in the review. Um, so really cool. Obviously, these are made in China, uh, but again, I really, I'm going to take this out one more time and lay it here. I really enjoy that clip point, uh, buoy style blade. Very, very nice. Oh, come on. You can focus. Ren and Stimpy are messing with me now because I mess with them. But look at that. Uh, just a great looking high flat grind. Of course, Well, is that flat or is it? Yeah, it's flat. It is a flat grind. Uh, very, very, very nicely done uh, on that. So really cool. We'll do a full review. And there's your better look at the scales there. Uh, we'll do a full review coming up very soon. Uh, guys, thank you so much. Uh, for your support, please give me a comment down below. Uh, give me a thumbs up and thanks for watching the Knives Fast channel.